cut it, my hair went down my antique kids with them high hair. So this is how much we're cutting off here. <gasps> Look at all that. <laughs> Good morning, Bax. I hope you're having a lovely day. What are we about to go do, Rosalind? Cut it. My hair went donate it to kids that don't have hair. You're going to cut your hair and donate it to kids that don't have hair? Uh -huh. Now, Rosalind, before we do this, I want to make sure you know it's going to take a while to grow back. Are you sure you want to cut it? Uh-huh. Yeah? Because I want to have some less tangles so, it, so the bus won't make, so they, a lot of tangles won't make the bus make my hair elastic. You want to have it shorter so you'll have less tangles when I brush it? Uh -huh, it will still have I some less tangles. It will still have some tangles. You understand that, right? Uh-huh. Okay. All right. So let's show them the before real quick. Let's show them what your hair looks like. Why you Look how long it is. It, I use like, I don't know. It looks pretty long, doesn't it? I think I use like Pocahontas. You do look a little bit like Pocahontas. A good ball. A good ball. Okay, turn around. I want to show them the back, the back of it. Look how long it has gotten. So we measured it, and it is officially long enough that she could donate it. Rosalind has only ever gotten one real haircut before. I will link that video in the iCard. And she was talking about it. She had been talking about it for a while, and then a few weeks ago when we were going to go do it, she decided that she didn't want to do it. <laughs> but then we've been talking about it a little bit more, and she's like been saying, I want to cut my hair and donate it to kids that don't have hair. Um, ever since I actually got my hair done, because I had a recent mommy makeover that I'll link in the iCard too. Um, so mom and Roslyn are going to go on a special trip to go get your hair cut. And we gotta hurry because I'm professor to my own I'm professor hair shine who's always start to shine my hair when I want it. Yep. To your own professional hairstylist who will style your hair. We had a long talk about how only professional hairstylists can style hair. We don't do it ourselves. Dad, you gonna be good with Irene? Yeah she'll be fine. Watch yeah. Pokemon or something. Figure it out. I think you meant to say Pocahontas is what you're watching. But whatever. Just poke something. Okay. All right. When we come back, she's going to look completely different. Are you excited? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Let's go. We're going on a big girl trip, Rosalind. Only big girls get to go on this trip. Are you excited? Uh-huh. Just you and me. Daddy has to stay home with baby sister. And make sure she doesn't cry. That's right. You think she's worried about you? Yes. That's okay. Daddy will reassure her. There's no reason to be worried. I'm so excited for you to get your hair cut. It's such a nice choice, too, that you want to give it to kids who don't have hair. Okay. All right. We are here. Um, so the place that we're donating her hair to is a place that I've donated my hair before. It's called Children with Hair Loss. And the reason why I like it I, is because... I'm professional hair uh, no, my professional hairstylist styled my hair. You have a different one. So, the reason I like children with hair loss to donate your hair is because they don't charge the people who receive the wigs like Locks of Love does. You only need eight inches, which is less than a lot of other places, and they'll take dyed hair. So I'll try to remember to link them down below, but if you literally just look up children with hair loss, that's the place. And according to the instructions, I have to take rubber bands and rubber band each side of her hair. So we're going to do that. And then we're going to go inside. All right. There it is. That's the before. You ready? You ready? It's in here. All right. You're going to wait your turn. So excited to donate it. Yeah. It's just long enough. You're so cute. All right. All brushed out. Put in a ponytail. Hey, is it donated? It is not donated yet, honey. She has to cut it first. That is very nice of you to donate, sweetie. Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing with your tongue? Are you wiggling your tooth? <laughs> you look like a lizard. So this is how much we're cutting off here. Right at eight inches. Perfect, honey. Alright, are you ready? 
here we go. This is such a nice choice, Roslyn. <gasps> Look at all that. Look at all the hair she cut. Oh God. Look at that. You're going to make some little girl very happy. That was a really nice choice. Yeah. <laughs> Not quite. There's a little more that has to happen. <laughs> Look at that, honey. Uh huh. And I was like, don't do locks a lot because yeah. they. Because they charge the kids. Yeah, and it's like. And they throw away a lot of the hair that comes in. And of course, if you're sending in hair that's not useful, that's one thing. But we, it's called Children with Hair Loss. And I think there's another one called Wigs for Kids. Mm -hmm. But I think it has to be a little longer for that one. But they'll take colored hair too, I think. Look at you. Wow, it almost came out <laughs> pretty like close. Yeah, look at that. So it kind of gave her like a little bit of an A-line, but I knew that was like going to happen mm -hmm. because uh, we pulled everything back. What do you think? Super short, but you like it? High five. What do you think, Roslyn? Do you like it? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. I'm so proud of you. That was such a nice thing you did. <laughs> She's like, oh, here. Thank you so much. You like it? Uh-huh. You ready to get down? Uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> Let's get down. So where are we going right now? to get a special hair bow for your new haircut? Okay, let's go pick it out. Look, here's hair bows or hair clips. I don't see, oh, over here's the hair bows. Right here. What one do you wanna buy? Look, which one? Or if you want, we can stop by this store and get one that matches this outfit. Do you wanna stop somewhere else? No. No, you wanna get one of these? Mm -hmm. Okay, which one do you want? <gasps> that one with the glitter? That is a good choice. Mm -hmm. Are you ready to show dad? Uh-huh. Okay, let's he, He's going to be so surprised. You think he's going to be so surprised? Yes. Okay. Here we go. Look at you. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Look at that you. Look at you. Look at you. You're so fancy. Yeah. Look at your haircut. Roslyn, who do you look like now? Snow White. Snow White, yes. It was so nice of you to cut off all wow. that hair. Roslyn, that's going to make somebody really, really happy. That's a really common choice. All the choice. kids who don't have hair. That's right. That's going to make somebody really, really happy. Who's, okay. Who's going? Who, Some kid, I'm sure. Who <laughs> is going? I don't know exactly. Who, I don't think you keep track of that. Who but. Another, another, another little, little girl, little boy who doesn't have any hair. This will help them have hair. It's going to make a little wig for them. And it's so easy to brush your hair now. Oh, you don't get snarls anymore, huh? Did you shared your hair? I've shared Mommy my hair shared before, hair yeah. Before. yeah. Dada has not. His hair Do you want to go look in the mirror? Look. Go look in the mirror. Good look. Okay. Wow, this mirror needs to be cleaned. Oh, look who woke up. Hi, Cranky. Go show baby sister. Look at it. Hey, look, look at it. Here. She just woke up. Okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. Oh, you want mommy? Oh, you want mommy. Okay. Do you like your new haircut? Yeah? It's a little short. Do you like that it's short? Yes. Who do you look like? Princess Elijah. Princess Elijah. and Moana. And my pencil. Mm-hmm. Honey, I'm so proud of you for giving your hair to kids that don't have them. Hey, go talk to 
curtsy with the this up, right? Are you going to show us how you curtsy? Very Look, good. Curtsy with the this up, right? Right. Very good curtsy, Rosalind. Oh, let's check your tooth. Show me your tooth. Let's see. It's so wiggly. Uh-huh. I think it's going to fall out very soon. Are you going to put it under your pillow when it falls out? Yeah. I don't understand you when you say it. Could you say yes or no? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are we being yeah, a baby? Yeah, 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 yeah. Baby. I cannot believe how like how different she looks now that it's cut. Um, the hairstylist had to go a little bit shorter because she like cut it a little short in the back. So because she had to donate it, she had to cut it a little bit shorter. But so it wasn't quite the picture that Rosin wanted, but Rosin seems really, really happy with it. And I told her, I was like, you look just like Snow White. And she's like, yes, and Mulan and Princess Rapunzel when her hair gets cut. And I was like, yes, you sure do. So that's only the second haircut that Rosin has ever got. She's never gotten it quite that short before. But hair grows and it will grow back. And um, the thing that's amazing to me about it is how, like, thick it looks where it was cut it doesn't look like that kind of fine hair that was was hers so I'm hoping that it will be easier to style now but um, yeah so children with hair loss that is where we are donating it what you do is you need to get at least eight inches of hair they will take colored hair and you have to put a rubber band on either side of it and then there's just like a form that you have to print out and mail in so I need to remember to print that out next time I'm at my parents house because we actually don't have a printer here or maybe I'll have Ken print it out and we'll mail all that hair in I cannot believe that that much got cut um, so thumbs up for donating her hair I'm very proud of her um, and for new changes if you're new consider hitting the bell and the subscribe button oh I wanted to mention too I on two different channels I've gotten comments where someone said I have hit the bell and I didn't get this notification so double check if you think that you hit the bell double check and click again um, there's a thing where like YouTube will still not send you all of the notifications you have to click and then select all notifications if you want to get all notifications it's like they're trying really hard to not let you be subscribed to people I find it very frustrating um, and it's because they think that their algorithm is smarter than you are but I feel like there still needs to be at least one section of YouTube where there's like subscribed you know so anyways like I said consider that and um, we will talk to you tomorrow, which is my audition, so hopefully I'll break a leg. Bye, guys.